So yeah, Costia. Very annoying. Uh, but it's, to be honest, I was kind of expecting something like this, you know. I think I'd gone almost to the end of May with no parasites. Listen to everybody else suffer with them. So, yeah, found Costia. And they are so hard to find. Magnification times 400 on your microscope. Oh my goodness me. Yeah, literally, they're little commas that just run around in circles. The way I found them was once I've done the, the scrape on the fish and put it on the on the slide, is to get a couple of drops of water and then put the, the top glass on and then look in the water around the mucus. And that's where they usually end up swimming, spinning around in little circles and being an annoyance. So what am I going to do about it? So I'm going to try something different this time. Last year when I found Costier, I did the uh, formalin and malachite green premix. So it comes in one bottle, you sort of dealt with it over a number of days, dosing, and then away you go from there. So this time, I'm going to try something different. I'm going to go for the formalin on its own and malachite green on its own and dose them separately. So why are you doing that? Because it's clip on lifestyle. We don't knock it until you've tried it. I'm going to try this. The other thing is, it's not cheap. Each bottle, not cheap at all. So we're going to go for this and I'm going to treat the pond as soon as I can. UV's got to be off, filters cleaned and all that kind of stuff. Now it says dosing both of these things. For example, formalin. You redose this every five to seven days up to three doses. That one. The malachite green, you dose, and then you repeat the dose 10 days later. So that's interesting. Two, when you mix them together, you put them both in at the same time, but with, when you do them separately, you have to do them separate times, which is interesting. However, I'm going to put them both in at the same time when I do the first dose. So it says I've got to apply them over a, a period of an hour so that the, there's no shock in the pond, which is fine. But what I've been told is that it's better to put the formalin in first, about an hour before, and then follow it up with the malachite green. Apparently it makes it better and it makes it work a little bit better. So that's interesting. So we, I'm gonna give that a blast and see if these two products are gonna do the job for me, but they're quite expensive. But the last time I used the, the premix, it, it kind of worked. Well, it must have worked, cause I, but I went into winter, you see, so whether, whether this is Costia that died off as I was going into winter, I don't know. You know, parasites are just a oh, pain in the backside. So anyway, so they're the ones. I'm going to start the dosing as of today and repeat the formula in five to seven days after the first dose and then redose after ten days with the Malachite Green. And hopefully we get rid of the little bleeders and we get back to some sort of normality. Maybe I'll just wait for the next parasite to come along. Let's crack on. Right, dosing day. So, got my formalin, got my malachite green, 1%. Now I've never done this separately before. I've always done them on the pre-mix stuff. So I've done my little calculations out here um, for my pond. So I'm not bothered telling you what the measures are for my pond because it's irrelevant. It's just for my pond. But apparently it says on here, don't get it wrong. Get your calculations very right, don't guess. So I've not, I've done everything very accurately. Um, the formalin, first dose, uh, apparently there's, there's three doses. Uh, repeat the dose every five to seven days for a maximum of three doses, that's the formalin. And then the malachite green is, um, repeat the dose 10 days later. So I had a, had a quick read up, uh, spoke to Steve at Pencoy and I'm gonna add both at the same time to go in. Now Steve's recommended that I put the formalin in first, about an hour before the malachite green, but I've got to put the formalin in over a period of an hour. So it's gonna be a couple of hours before I get this done. So I'll get this mix, get the formalin mixed, get that, start putting that in over a period of an hour. Once that's in, leave for an hour, then start getting the malachite green in. And apart the malachite green is similar. Yeah, slowly apply to the pond over a one hour period. So this is same as well. So both shook up quite nicely. Shake both bottles, rock and roll, no dancing. 
So I'll get these added. The formalin's gonna go into this bucket. Malachite green's going in theirs. I'm gonna do the formalin first, get that in, and then add it over the period of an hour. So Malachite's gone in, give it a quick stirry stirry with the special stirring stick. And then we'll add this over a period of one hour. Crack on. Right, the turn of Malachite Green. So, uh, again, what I'm putting in my bucket is irrelevant to yourselves because this is measured from my pond, but apparently you've got to get it very right. Because if you get it wrong, it could be bad. In fact, I'm going to put some gloves on for this, because this is that stuff that stains your hand. So lid back on, gloves on. Gloves on. Shaky, shaky. Mixy, mixy. Pond water. Malachite, green, 1%. Uh, what's for my pond again? That many. So we'll do... Okay, mixy mixy. Um, and this will go in now. I've got a few more moments before this formalin stuff's been in for the hour. Uh, over an hour, so uh, yeah, long process this, and it looks quite expensive as well. So I don't know, see how it works, eh? Because if it's like 15 quid a bottle, two bowls, um, and it takes a couple of hours to put in, jeez, never get that time back in your life, will you? <laughs> um, so okay, just give it a bit and put that in a minute. Right, this is interesting. So it's gone in now, a few hours wasted. Not wasted time, is it? I don't know. But time that's gone that I won't get back again. So that's all gone in now, two of the two separate medications. Um, so the second formula is going to go in five to seven days later, but the malachite green in, you just repeat after 10 days. So I'll do five, I'll probably do five days. So it'll be five days, then you've got to win another five days for the last formula to go in, and then you do the malachite again. So they go in together, then the middle bit is separately, formally in, and then a few days later, the Malachi goes in together. Anyway. Um, so yeah, so, so there you go, so it's in. Uh, I'll do the repeat ones in the five to seven days, and then five to seven days, and then the Malachi green in 10 days time. So, look at that, it's all up by the window now. Oh, they're cured. Oh, yeah, superb. Just put it in there, all right, 20 minutes. After they've all got in. <laughs> Three hours. I don't know. So anyway, we'll continue this video in just over 10 days' time. <laughs> Right, we've done the, the second lot of formula went in the other, a few days back. We've got the third one to go in now. I've just started putting the formula in earlier. I'm halfway through doing the last Malachi green. Progress so far is this. Uh, fish are off the bottom. As you can see, one of my chugs is now, seems to be running around looking for more food, which is positive. Um, they all seem to be still sitting in the corner though a little bit. And not at the, they used to come all to the window first thing in the morning, they all at the window, dun dun dun, waiting for food, which they're not doing at the moment. As you can see, they're not by the window either. I've been trying to do it at the same time every time, same time of day. Um, they always say, don't leave it till late at night, don't leave it before you go on LLD. You know, just basically saying, keep an eye on the pond and see how, what, what's going on. So that's what I've been doing. So I've just got this last bit of formalin to go in. Uh, sorry, the last bit of malachite green to go in. And then we're done. And then I can stick the UV back on. Uh, I did do a pond clean a couple of days ago because obviously it's been, you know, 10, 10, 10 days or so um, since the first lot went in. So I've got to now suss that. 
So I had to do, I had to do a pond clean, uh, I had to do a filter clean because there was getting a bit of muck in there because I'm still feeding what I'm, what I'm doing on what, what they'll take. So I don't know, I'm gonna give it a couple more days and see what happens. One thing I also did as well is I put the brush, sorry, not the brush. I put my net in as well, put my net in the pond so that that gets a, a dose of formalin and malachite as well, because you just never know. So it cleanses these, any tools you have that you put in and out the pond or sit around waiting to go in the pond. It's always an idea you're supposed to put them in as well. So it gives them a clean up as well. So this has been in uh, and I, to be honest, I poured, uh, when I poured the formula and the malachite in the second one, I think I put this, uh, no, yeah, the first one, sorry, I put this in then. So I don't know, we're gonna wait and find out, we'll see, if, see what happens to the fish now. Is it good, is it bad? Let's find out. Right, so it's been <clears throat> 10 to 14 days since the first application of separates. So, conclusion time. Never used these separately, the formula in the Malachi Green. Apart from the expense, you know, 15 quid each, wow. Get premix for a lot cheaper than that. I hear you say. Whew. I hear loads of you say, I know. This is, this is Coupon Lifestyle, we have to try these things. Uh, just to let you guys know what it is. So yeah, conclusion, I'm quite happy with the results, to be honest. Fish aren't, aren't flashing around anymore. Fish is a lot more eating. There's no more spitting food out. I think it's cured Costia in the time it took for these bottles to say, do what I need to do, you know, i.e. three doses of this and two of this yeah. in between each other. So yeah, I'm quite happy with this. Um, I, I don't know whether I'd spend 30 quid on it again, but it has done a really good job. But the premix did a good job as well, but I was continually dosing with that over, I think it was a 10 day period. Anyways, so I'm just in the process of now doing a water change, UV's back on, um, away we go from there really. The only thing is it's messed up my water now. Not my personally with the ponds. So, so I'm going to, uh, I've got an idea. Ping, light bulb moment. Um, that we're gonna do in the next video to see if I can speed up my green water clearing a little bit quicker. Hmm, little idea there on, on that bombshell. Thanks very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe down the bottom, click the like, ding the bell for notifications, share to all your friends. I'm getting faster at this. Thanks very much. This was Quick Pan Lifestyle.